Having one domain controller is not recommended because it creates a single point of failure. If the only domain controller goes down in the organization, big outages will occur resulting in a loss of operations. To avoid this single point of failure you need to have a secondary domain controller. A second DC will load balance the services and minimize the risk of critical services going down. I will walk through the steps to add a second domain controller in a Windows Server 2019 domain. This is my ADC scenario. So how to configure ADC? Go to new server. Go to server manager. And Install Active Directory Domain Services. Click Promote this server to a domain controller. It can add a domain controller to an existing domain. Fill domain name. Ars.local. Click on Change and put Administrator and Password. Put DSRM password. Replicate to select ars.local Prerequisites check then Click install. After install domain click close.
After install ADC then log on as Domain Administrator After log on go to Server Manager. Click Tools click Active Directory User and Computer. I am checking my additional domain controller is proper configure or not. Go to DC and create new user for checking purpose. I am creating a new user. Yashin Active Directory user and Yush user is created in DC. I am going to additional domain controller. Yush user will automatic created in additional domain controller. It means my additional domain controller is working fine. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel.